the arts acting in a way to reinforce the beauty that we have. Public art adds a spectrum of interest um, that really no building itself, no landscaping itself can really bring. This is born out of our desire to continue to make initiatives that will create a more interesting shopping environment. The art is actually a key piece of that. We really want to have something for everybody and so a mural like this added to our mall adds sort of that community sense. A lot of my work comes from looking at things that I'm inspired by in nature or in science. Just like the motion of, of things around us. To me it's all about time in a mural or time we have on the planet and so for this particular mural I was trying to capture the, the time of sunrise and sunset and the movement of the sun and the moon. The colors on these walls that have been created definitely draw your attention and kind of shows um, that the mall is you know, transforming and uh, trying to be more accepted to the arts and the arts community. Murals build a sense of community. We had so much success with this in other markets, we decided to bring it to Utah. I like to call it creative placemaking. This public-private partnership approach recognizes the arts as vital drivers of community revitalization and development. Sandy's been working really hard to create an environment where you live, work, and play. And that is what the Karens District is all about. You know, so many times we think about just high-density housing and malls and shopping, and what it really is, is it's a place for people to come together.